What up, Fish Tank people? FishTankTV.com, Dustin's Fish Tanks, bringing it to you on a Friday. All fired up, excited, because it's snowy and cold outside, but I get to go inside of this nice warm greenhouse. Oh, yeah. Here's what's going on, people, yelling and screaming, because the kids ain't around. Did I mention I'm feeling a little bit better? I got my hair cut for you all. Sorry, I will never make a video looking that bad again. I looked at that and was like, oh my God, I look terrible. So here's what's up. I want to talk today about flu balls. I want to talk about filters. I want to talk about the filter. If you said, Dustin, what's your one filter that you would pick to take with you if you only could pick one? I'm telling you, it's a flu ball, folks, all right? They didn't pay me to say that. I don't sell them yet on Aquatic Jungles, but I wish I could. I could probably figure out a way to do it. I just want to drop it on you. Flu ball filters freaking rule, all right? I've got an Eheim downstairs. I like the flu ball more, okay? Even the guy who sell this stuff the guy in the hacky aquarium said yo you can get a flu ball you can go ahead and you can get the eheim with the built-in heater or whatever um and then you can go and whatever or you can just buy a flu ball and then get a separate heater i love the flu balls i got one on here i got one on here i'm gonna get one over here and here and here i love them all right i think they're fat filters okay anything over a 75 gallon in my opinion deserves a flu ball you owe it to yourself to get a sick filter, all right? I had a guy named Tony who used to run Just Fish. I had a bunch of pieces and parts of this old crappy canister. He goes, dude, I'm not going to let you get off to the hobby like that with a canister filter. I don't want you that to have to have that bad of an experience or that kind of a start. The dude gave me a flu ball filter. Changed my life. Changed my life. Guy was a complete asshole too, by the way. Excuse my French, but very, very knowledgeable. If anybody ever went to Just Fish in Lexington, you would know that dude. Fubal filters dominate. They take care of business. I'll show you this one over here. Running, pumping, just dominating it, cleaning this tank out, completely drain this tank. What do I like about them? Let's see here. You can turn them off right here like this. So you can like flip this up so the water's done. So you hardly just boom, it's off. Put it back down. Water's on again, pumping some more. I mean, just easy to turn on and off. Fairly quiet, um, lasts a long time. I hardly ever clean mine out. I just let them go. Um, they do a great job. I haven't tried any of like the G series. I don't even know what series they're running now. The FX5, in my humble opinion, is like a classic, just amazing, epic filter that everyone should have if you have a tank like a 125 or better i think it's awesome people will disagree with me eheim was good to me okay eheim gave me a filter they saw me bashing their stuff and i'm still picking fluval all right i'm very adamant about this um easy to start easy to drain the, the media kits blah 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 fluval just has it going on i should really talk to them about some sort of sponsorship by the way but no i love it i think they're good stuff i'm running them on here I'm still, I've been talking about it forever. I'm trying to get another 125 over here. I'd put a flu ball on there, okay? So that's what's going on. I also want to show you this. Here's the temperature. Now, grant you it's sitting in the sun. Here's the temperature of my tanks right here, okay? Look at that. Running there a little under 70, or oh, excuse me, a little above 70. So I'm digging it. Aquatic Jungles is bumping. I'm feeling better. I hope you can tell. Life's treating me good. Got a lot of ridiculous IRS in right now, by the way. Yeah, it's not such a ridiculous one, but some of the ones back here are pretty dope. So, real pumped about it, real excited about it. The Guigia. I actually, oh, I want to show this too. This tank looks like death, and I apologize to Steve for tearing apart his tank. He really doesn't care. But it's actually got new growth even in the tiny cold right here. If you can see that little, uh, little spot right there, new growth coming in off of that. So, I just want to show that. I'm excited. I'm feeling good. I got to go pick my girls up. Flu balls dominate. If I had to pick uh, a filter that I'd take with me on a 75 gallon or above, it'd be that filter right there or maybe an FX5. So talk to me about flu balls. Let me know what you think. Feeling better, folks. Can you tell? Later.